You said six minutes, right? Yeah, okay, there it goes. So have you ever wondered how you would pay off all your student loans? Or what would you do if you got laid off from your job? Or if your kids were sick? Or how you would buy a home for your family to live in? The answer is simple, so I'm the Navy. In just my short two years in the Navy, I've already earned half a degree and didn't have to pay any student loans. When the rest of my friends and family were stressing about if they would still have a job, I was thankful I didn't have to worry. When my son broke his arm and I wasn't worried about how I will pay the emergency room bill, I don't have to worry about how I can afford a nice home in a decent neighborhood for my kids to live in. You may wonder how I can do all this? I told you, join the Navy. One of the benefits of being in the Navy is the free school I receive. While I serve on active duty, I can go to school for absolutely free. My only cost is books, no tuition. But it doesn't stop there. Just for serving active duty, I am eligible for the Montgomery GI Bill. Basically, the bill pays for me to go to school after I'm off of active duty. With the new revised GI Bill, they will give me a monthly housing allowance, which on the average is around $1,100. They'll so also give me an extra $1,000 per semester to buy books. And if you play it right and you don't go to the most expensive school, it's still all the way free for you. Some of you may be thinking, I already went to school and got my degree, so what do I care? Well, if you have like thousands of dollars to student loans, they'll pay them off for you. Now you have the education but no experience needed to get the job. So if you do get if you do get a job, you may be wondering how secure is your job. That is the good thing about the Navy. You can get the job experience you need and a steady paycheck. The experience can be anything from law enforcement, administrative, or as technical as computers or flying airplanes. The possibilities are endless. You are like, yeah, but I don't want to end up going to war. That is why the Navy is different from the Army, Marines, or Air Force. If we are all at war, then who is left on the ship? Yes, the Navy goes to war, but not in the large numbers that you're used to hearing on the Army and the Marines. And not only have you received the job training that you needed to get hired as a civilian, you won't get fired. With the unemployment rate still increasing, according to the Bureau of Statistics, last updated June of this year, a nice, reliable job with a decent paycheck can relieve the worry that your family and friends have. Just the Virginia unemployment rate, as you can see from the year 2000 to 2008, it fluctuates and it goes ups and downs. So who really wants to have that unreliable? One year it's good, one year it's not. Currently, in this year, the unemployment rate just in Virginia is 4%. In the U.S. alone this year, 250,000 people have lost their jobs. The ones with jobs don't make enough to make it worthwhile to work. The, the base pay in the Navy can range from anywhere from 1200 a month to over 2000 a month. Depending on the, your state of residence, you may not even have to pay state taxes. So knowing that you will always have a job with a steady income allows you to always have the family you wanted. Having kids can cost a pretty penny. The average birth in America can cost between six to $8,000. That is just a normal delivery, not including all doctor visits before you actually deliver. As long as you are on active duty, all your medical and dental benefits are free. Once you have a baby, they need medical care too. Once again, if you're on active duty, the medical is free. If you have never had a kid, you'll know that they are very expensive. As they get older, they start having accidents and breaking bones and going to the ER, which is expensive, but it's free in the military. Now that you have these beautiful babies, where do you live? In the ideal world, a house with a big kitchen, enough rooms, and a yard for your family could be expensive. That is just another benefit of the Navy. Along with the base pay you receive, on top of that, you will receive a basic housing allowance. Just for this area alone, depending on your rank, the housing allowance can be up to 1200 a month. With that money, you can pay a mortgage or have some, and have something to show for all your work. You were like, I can't get a mortgage. Well, guess what? In the military, you can. The military offers a VA loan. VA meaning veteran assistance. That is anybody who has served in the military. The VA loan offers closing, closing cost assistance, no money down, locked in interest rates. If you already own a home, they can help you refinance or give you a loan to remodel your home. So if the ideal of free school and medical isn't enough, Remember, the loan you can get for your family to have a nice place to live, the steady job. Oh, John, Lieutenant Wood, NIT. If this isn't enough, visit Navy.com to read about the many more benefits I didn't cover.
And if you don't understand what we are fighting for or don't believe in war, you can still pray for our church. Thank you. Hi, hi, stop that shit.